Yo, it's your boy KNE, aka the Whiskey Boss. What's going on, peoples? Happy Thirsty Thursday. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back, man. How's everybody doing, man? God bless. Salute. We did it again. We did it again. Now, I know y'all looking at this bottle right now like, damn, what? Is this boy finna do a uh, review on an empty-ass bottle? <laughs> now, I got this bottle a couple of weeks ago from one of my player's partners, man. Um, one of my player partners, man. He uh, had a birthday, and I never had Jameson uh, the Black Barrel. That's what this is. The Black Barrel... Uh, I did the regular review on the Jameson, but I never did the Black Barrel, and I was interested. He was like, well, man, I got a little left, man. Tasty, check it out. Don't do review, man. Just, just let me know. So, here it is, man. He had this in the cooler, so that's why the label was a little, you know, deteriorated, man. You know what I'm saying? But this is it, man. Jameson. This is uh, Black Barrel. Black Barrel Irish Whiskey. This is a liter. 40% alcohol. With a 40% alcohol, y'all know what that means, man. It's 80 proof. And you know what 80 proof is to the whiskey balls? Kool-Aid. <laughs> it's soft, man, but you know, hey, hey, sometimes that soft, man, look at whiskey, man, can, can just do you right, man, put you in that chill mode, chill mood and mode. So um, let's jump into it, man. Y'all know how I do my videos, man, and all that. I got a little left, so... Said, yo, I'm going to do a review for this for you, man. You know what I'm saying? This is for all y'all. All y'all. All, all the y'all. Now, the bottle is regular, man. Regular bottle. It's just nothing fancy. They didn't even try to do nothing fancy. They, they probably got these bottles from <laughs> Swap Meat or somewhere, man. You know, cheap, cheap, cheap ass bottle. Cork, which is pretty cool. You know, I love corks for some reason. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. I think, I think the liter usually go for like $45 or something in that price range. Uh, I've seen it before. Uh, y'all know, I'm, I'm not a big fan of Irish whiskey, man. Jameson is cool, but I'm not a big fan. I'm not, you know, but you know, the whiskey boss, man, I, 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 I try anything, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I like to, I like to explore, man. So, here it is, man. Jameson, Black Barrel. It's not really that black, man. <laughs> it ain't really that black, man. It ain't really that black, though. Um, it kind of look like some... This is like some... I'm going to say brown, man. Like, light brown. It's kind of like a beer color, man. Probably a little bit darker than your regular beer, but it's not very dark. It's not dark what I um, expected a... Um, I guess a black barrel to be. Um, like I said before, usually when something is, is like black and, you know, something, something black, uh, Hennessy black or this black, it's, it's supposed to be like more of a bold uh, feeling or a bold taste, a bold something. So uh, we're going to see if, if Jameson does that, man. Well, let me get out of those now, man. You know what's funny, man? It smells like Jameson. You get that whole Lucky Charm smell, but it's not as sweet on the nose. You know what I'm saying? Like a regular Jameson. Like it's like I smell some alcohol with it's like some it's like some Lucky Charms poured in some rub rubbing alcohol. <laughs> it's like somebody got a box of cereal, poured that Lucky Charms in there, grab that rubbing alcohol, put it there, mix it up, sniff it, there you go, man. You get Jameson black, black barrel. I'm sorry for all my Irish whiskey lovers, man. Y'all probably hate me right now. Uh, whiskey boss is always talking about fuck him. Ah, fuck him. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. It's all good. You know what I'm saying? But uh, that's what it smells like, man. For real, it smells like uh, Lucky Charms with some alcohol. Like it, you smell that that uh, that sweetness, and I can smell some alcohol to it. That's funny because it's only eighty proof. Hmm. Well. This is it, man. Thank y'all for tuning back in. I hope y'all drink with me. Y'all know, I, man, this, man, this is one of the main reasons I love doing this because, you know, I hope everybody toasts. If 
I can get everybody to toast with me at one time, all my subscribers to toast with me at one time, it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. So here it is, man. Uh, I'm finna go ahead and put it on the palette and uh, see what let's, let's see what this do, man. Let's see what this Jameson do, man. Cheers, y'all. Happy Thirsty Thursday. Okay, okay, okay. All right, when you first sip in the Jameson Black Barrel, <clears throat> man, um, still getting that that candy taste is like that. The regular Jameson taste, that sweetness, like a cereal, um, let me see. You like that cereal taste? You get that, but that disappears quick. Um, and then I taste some alcohol, man, like. You getting a sweet note, and then you getting the alcohol, um, you taste the alcohol. It tastes like Jameson, but actually uh, a little bit bolder. It's still smooth. It's still smooth. Uh, nothing's going to change that. It's still smooth. Uh, a little bit bolder than the regular uh, Jameson. And when I mean, uh, when, when I say to me bolder than the regular Jameson, probably a little bit more stronger. To me, this is my opinion. It's a little bit more strong. Like the regular Jameson, like you probably can drink a whole bottle of that, and you know you get fucked up later. But you know what I'm saying you you won't really taste that that little alcohol. This you does taste the alcohol. Like you gonna drink and you are gonna feel a little of the alcohol. You're not gonna drink this all by yourself. It's bolder than the regular. Um, let me write this, man. Kane, a.k.a. the Whiskey Boss, I give Jameson a black barrel. Here it is, man. I'm going to have to get this. Five point five out of a ten. A five point five out of a ten. <clears throat> it's better than the regular Jameson's to me. If you're a Jameson drinker, uh, you try to the too light. Like the Jameson regular is just too light. It's it's too, it's too candyish. It's too easy. You know what I'm saying? Get this. Grab this. Um, I'm still not impressed with Jameson. I'm not. I'm maybe because the whole Irish whiskey thing. Uh, I'm not impressed. Would I buy it? Uh, I can't say would I buy it again because I ain't even buy it the first time. But what I. <laughs> Would I buy it? Probably not, man. I, I probably won't. The only way, only way I would buy it is if I got some company coming over, and that's a, and everybody that's co that's coming over like Jameson. That's the only of uh, the only way I purchase this. Um, yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad, but uh, I'm still not a fan of the Irish whiskey, man. Check it out, viewers, subscribers, man. I need y'all help, man. Challenge me, man. Challenge me. If y'all know an Irish whiskey that uh, you think that I will rate over a six, a six and up, like, because I believe the regular Jameson, I gave it a five. This is a 5.5, .5, a little bit above than the regular Jameson. If y'all know an Irish whiskey that y'all would think, yo, the boss got to give this a six. Yo, the boss has to give this a seven. Comment below, man. Let me know. Talk to me, man. Please, man. Oh, man. Open my eyes, man. Put me in that lane of Irish whiskey where I can be like, okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? I haven't met nothing yet. Um, like it's, I'm not a fan of Irish whiskey, but I want to, if that makes sense, man. I, I was, you know what I'm saying, want to open another door with that. But please, all my, my Irish whiskey fans, man, if y'all know, if y'all sipping on something, you know, and you know, and it, it, it I'm not spending over 60, $65 for it. So, 
Put me under the sixty-five dollars and under price range, man. Don't get, don't tell me something that costs a thousand dollars, five hundred, three hundred, two hundred, or even one hundred, man. Sixty-five and down. Y'all know how, what I usually like, you know what I'm saying? But if y'all know an Irish whiskey that y'all would think a whiskey boss would have to give it a six and up, let me know. Comment below and uh, challenge me, man. Challenge me and. Uh, I'm gonna give you my, I'm gonna give y'all my honest opinion like I always do, man. Like I always do, man. But that's my review on Jamison, man. Thank y'all for tuning in. Happy Thursday, Thursday, Happy Thursday, Thursday. Can't wait to see y'all next week. Don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be good, man. You know what I'm saying? God bless, man. See y'all next Thursday, Thursday. Peace. Oh,